Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel. This is Core Luck, and we're part two of our sand waterfall um, Bob the Worm DIY creation over here. So check it out, get a good look at it. Uh, we're gonna go take it over to the tank and we're gonna put it inside right now. So I did do a little cleaning up on the tank, remove some things that we had in there and made it nice and easy to drop in. So we're gonna test it out. Then we're gonna just um, decorate it and finish it up. So I'll turn it on for you guys in one second. We're gonna drop it in here, pour some sand in the nozzle and see how it works out. So let's go do that. Okay, plugged it in, it's running right now. I can see the current, it's kicking up a lot of power. I may have to turn it down. But this is some larger granule sand, so it may need the power to push it up to the top. So we'll find out right now. I'm gonna take a scoop full, pick some up and throw it in here. And I should have taken out a little bit of the water. So let me go do that so I don't overflow this tank. Okay, took out some of the water. Oh, now I gotta pull my sleeve up. <laughs> okay, the bottle worm is still in his hole, so hopefully he doesn't decide to bite me. And I'm gonna throw in some sand. <laughs> Let's see. Did it do anything? Yes, it did. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna have to get a spoonful because this tank is deep and I can't really reach. Um, I'm just trying to throw sand at the top. <laughs> And I'm watching it spit out while holding the camera. It's a little challenging. Um, okay. All while trying not to get eaten by the bottle worm. <laughs> Yay! Alright, so I am going to have to turn the pump down a little bit. It's spraying pretty hard. Looks like a popcorn machine over here just spitting out kernels. Um, but yeah, it's running, so at least it works. I'll put another handful in there. Let's see what happens. So, I don't know if you guys can see over here, the pump is suspended up in the air, so that's why sand doesn't get into it. The pump goes down, oops, my thing is crooked, I didn't even realize till now. There we go. <laughs> and if I pick this up, watch the bottom worm will come out of his hole if I pick it up and touch him. He don't like it, he gets mad. See his head? There he comes out, right there. He knows I'm wiggling it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Don't bite me, don't bite me. Yeah, he's seven feet long, guys. He's wrapped up in there. Let's see if he'll come out a little more. His butt may be under there. He's probably pissed. Oh, that's why. I'm probably setting a rock on his ass. <laughs> the whole bottom of this rock is his body. It looks like he's just coiled up in there. Um, but yeah, we'll, we won't mess with him too much. Like I said, my hand's in there. And the sand waterfall is running over here. It's doing a little little bit at a time I didn't put much sand in there and it has to cascade on its own weight so if you put enough in there it'll roll down into the cup so we'll throw a little bit more in there watch it for a few seconds uh, maybe tune the pump down a little bit and then we'll decorate this thing so let's do that all without getting bit y'all watch for the bottle worm and let me know if he gets close to my hand right It's like a wood chipper. Okay, so um, let me clean this thing up a little bit, guys, and then I'll show you this next part. Probably, or I'll save it for another video. We'll see what happens. But, um,. I can't wait to decorate this and make it look a little bit prettier. Usually what I do too is I try to clog the pump by dumping a whole bunch of sand in it and seeing what happens. So I should probably do that as well.
you know, it's a very gentle funnel. Normally I make like a 90 degree steep edge so the sand just has to push itself in. Um, this is more like a dinner plate with a little hole in the center. So the sand is probably just getting bunched up there. Um, so I'll have to make it a little bit more selective where I have it fall. But not too bad. Um, so I cloudied the water up a little bit just by grabbing handfuls of sand. Uh, the bobworm won't mind, it's um, camouflage for them. 